All right, Shalom Kaysen here, and I am going to show you how to download the Talk To app on your mobile device. The first thing you're going to do is go to the Play Store, and you're going to search for Talk T A W K Two, and it's going to pop up there. And then you go ahead and uh, click it. I've already installed it. You go through the steps to install it. You go ahead and open it. And I'm already logged in, so I'm going to sign out and sign back in. You're going to see a screen like this. You put in your email, your password. And this would be, of course, after you've already signed up for an account on the Talk to Desktop website. You can't just start here. You have to get the account first then after you get your account you go ahead and download the app so I'm gonna sign in and what you're gonna see is this screen to start with which has visitors and agents and uh, this is whoever you might have added as far as agents on your uh, dashboard and the visitors is somebody who's basically visiting your website there are a couple of options in here the first one is chat. Of course, that's where we were. And then we have change status. You can change your status to online, away, or invisible. And these are actually showing the different websites that I have um, used. This one, which is italic italicized. Did I say that right? I, anyway, it's in italics. That is just actually your personal talk to chat page. So each talk to account gets their own personal page. So somebody could, I mean, you could use that to chat with people. I don't know. I mean, there's lots of different ways you could use it. But uh, this is a, a website, my personal website. And this is another website that I, I am a, an agent where I can chat. So you can turn on or off any of these. And if it's off, of course, nobody is going to be able to contact you. And next one is uh, where you're logged in. So they're going to be showing where I'm logged in at. And um, I really don't. These are IP addresses. I really don't know. Um, one of these is my home uh, laptop. I don't know what this other one is. But you can see where you, you're logged in. And you can also go into the settings here. And you can pick different ringtones that are available. And there's lots of different ones you can pick from that will ring when somebody comes to your site. You can have it vibrate and you can have a new message notification, meaning the chat request notification means that somebody is opened up a new chat window. The new message notification means you're having a message with this person and they've just sent you a, another message. There's also in-app notifications such as a new visitor coming to your website. Um, this is not uh, activated automatically, but I personally like to activate this. This is a visitors online and notification showing the number of visitors browsing pages you have enabled. This notification cannot be dismissed. I really like this and I'm gonna show you how it works really quick. I'm going to go on my desktop here and go to one of the sites where I am a um, agent. And you're going to see right now how the notification is going to pop up um, showing me that there is indeed someone who is um, available online and and that will pop up at the top of the screen and of course you have you can have that vibrate or ring and then you have do not disturb as well so that no one will be uh, coming on and uh, that's pretty much it for the app so here we have we have one visitor and it's not showing be probably because I'm using a screen recorder but I have a visitor here who is on the weddings page. What's really cool about this is if I join, um, 
it's going to show up on the computer that I've joined. So on their computer, on our website, it's going to show my face and my name. Not only that, but if they haven't started a chat, I can start a chat, uh, which will pop up in uh, whatever window they're in. And I could say, hello, do you have any questions or anything like that? So once you click join, your face is going to pop up there to say, hey, whoever you are. And then you can put some text in here and say whatever it is you want to say and hit send. The person can choose to respond or not, but you've already extended your hand. You've already you're already uh, interacting with this person in a live environment, which totally changes the dynamic of websites completely. You know, uh, this capability was not available before. So I think that it's really exciting to be able to use talk to which is free to engage with um, co possible clients who are on your website looking for your products. And that is pretty much it for the tutorial of the talk to app. Uh, thank you very much.